the Planting FX for Revit plugin is a vital piece of the BIM workflow for landscape architects using Revit. The tools in this plugin are designed to look and feel the same as our planting tools in the AutoCAD plugin, so that landscape architects getting started in Revit that have used Land Effects before have one less thing to learn while switching softwares. At a glance, the workflow is easy, leaving you with more time to design. Add plant species with all the right data. Place plants quickly with parameters already set. Label groups of plants. Verify that everything's labeled correctly. Run a schedule in a click. And manage your planting plan standards office-wide. After installing the plugin, make sure to set up your library folder and support ID. The library folder will be the location where all our ready-to-use families will auto-download as you use them and acts as a place for you to store your own custom families that you'd like to connect to Land Effects. We recommend keeping this in your Land Effects server folder, but it can be anywhere, including in a shared network or online location. When using the plugin, you'll need to first create the Land Effects project number to assign to this Revit project file. The project list will pull up the same secure cloud data list that you might already use in any of our other plugins. If you use Land Effects in AutoCAD already, this list will already be full of your office's existing projects. The data is uploaded instantly, making cross-platform or multi-user workflows easy if you need them. Work where it works for you. With a project assigned, your next stop is the plant manager. This is where you can keep a full list of plant species for this project placed or unplaced. Add a new plant and grab whatever you need from our plant database of over 43,000 species and counting. New plants are reviewed and added to the master database every week based on the species that other land effects designers are adding. Edit your plant with everything you need to specify in your design. The plant names and code are editable and the available sizes are customizable to the sizes available at nurseries in your region in your plant size preferences. Assign a ready to use 2D 3D family symbol or assign your own custom family symbol. The Land Effects plant families are a small file size for fast performance while drafting and tied together with a great 2D linework symbol so each species in your plan view looks professional and distinct. They're also Enscape ready if you need to render later. Save time in each new project by using the import tool in the plant manager instead. Import a plant from a past project that's already set up with the right code, size, and symbol so you can skip straight to placing. Speaking of placing, it's as easy as clicking the place button and clicking down on your plan. Plants will insert at the level of the floor or topography where you clicked, and both the 2D and 3D symbols will be scaled according to the symbol width in your plant info. Use the copy along tool to place a plant along a drawn spline at the spacing you need. Copy plants using our Match Plant and Match Plant Properties tools instead of the native Revit copy commands. This ensures the parameters copy correctly to allow the Verify and Highlight tools to work. Place ground cover plants onto floors. Use Edit Plant on any Land Effects symbol to see what it is. Ground covers can use a spacing to count plants based on a natural spacing calculation or no spacing to instead use the square area. With Edit Plant, you can change the plant's information or symbol and Land Effects will update the changes across the plan. 
use highlight on a plant and highlight all the species of that plant in the drawing. This can help you identify efficient groups to label with a group label or connecting line label. Use highlight on a label to see all the plants counted by it. Then use verify labels to make sure no plants were accidentally missed. Finally, clicking the schedule tool creates a schedule with sizes and quantity ready to place on a sheet. You can edit the schedule style to meet your needs. All of these tools together create accurate and professional planting plans right inside Revit and benefit from our fantastic customer support and learning documentation. You won't need to learn complex manual workarounds and algorithms in Revit, and you can even use the export and import tools to work across Revit, AutoCAD, SketchUp, and Rhino as needed. But most exciting of all is all the tools that are continually being added. If you know land effects, you know we update frequently with new features and improvements. There's a lot on the list as we aim to bring all the capability of our AutoCAD plugin over to Revit, including color render, concept plants, plant mixes, more placement tools, and improved photo callouts. You can look forward to all of these being added soon. Contact us to try this out today and be on the cutting edge of a better BIM workflow for landscape architects in Revit.